Wait, is it working? Okay, yeah, it's working. Uh, oh, no, I didn't put the game on the stream. How are they going to know what video game I'm playing? Oh, no. It's, it's... Man, I wonder what game Bluefield could possibly be streaming. Dude, I don't know. He the plays only so game many... Bluefield could ever be streaming ever. Uh, oh, I wonder what it could be. Soccer Beach. I love that video game. Nah, That's Halo video Infinite. Game. Halo Oh, God. It would be funny if you and I would stream. We were streaming and we were doing Halo Infinite, doing multiplayer. Oh God, I'm so I'm so bad at the multiplayer in Halo. Though. I'm not just... hor. I'm not great, but I'm not horrible at it. One second, I'm trying to find your stream. Bluey, yeah, I need where to. Are you? I need to put it in the the Discord and at everybody because I'm obnoxious. Um, at everyone, please do not announce to the Discord when you are going to masturbate. This has been a reoccurring issue. Um. Wait, what the fuck? Video unavailable. The video is private? Uh, it says it's public. Never mind, we're good. Hold on, let me... Oh, we're good. Yep. Is it working? I know, I know, I found it. Yay! Alright, well, um... I forgot the sound. I forgot I still have my sound on for your stream, so I heard myself. I was confused for a second. <coughs> what? Oh, what? Yeah. Of I course, you still have Goku Drip. Dude, what is wrong? What's wrong with Goku Drip? Nothing is wrong with Goku Drip. I think I think there is something wrong with Goku. I think no. you have something against Goku Drip. I got nothing against Goku Drip, motherfucker. I don't know, but I think you're lying. I I don't think you're. I mean, I know you're not this a liar. Why, you're not a liar, damn, but you're certainly not a. Up. You're not a liar, but you're not a truther either. So. Oh my god. Yeah, you're definitely not a truther. Um. Drake, where's the defense attorney? What? You don't remember what happened with Drake Bell? Who the fuck is Drake Bell? He sounds you like someone I would run over with a car. <laughs> I keep forgetting when I ne sometimes I just don't notice when you're gonna make a stupid joke like that. I wasn't joking. Actually, I, I was jo YouTube. I was joking. Um, yeah. Oh, wasn't he the guy that like anyone. he turned himself in because he was like a pedophile or something? No. Okay. Okay. Well, what happened is that. So I'll admit, story's a bit weird. I don't know the full context. Of YouTube, don't quote me. I don't know the full context. Forgive me. I don't follow celebrities like a fucking worshiper. Like yeah. other people do, okay? So I can't say I know everything about what celebrities do or do not do. Yeah. Case of Drake, there's... So, basically, he did plead guilty. Basically, what happened is that either... He was either sexting a minor... Sorry, YouTube. Now you're going to demonetize Whoa. this. Or... He was supposed to be babysitting a 15-year-old. Those are the two stories I keep hearing. I don't know. That's I don't weird. care. All I know is the memes are good. Where is the he now? The memes are fire. In jail, I'm assuming. Oh. What? Well, yeah, so he was the yeah. guy from, <coughs> from Jake, Drake, Drake and Josh. Josh. I love big yeah. titties. I love... He, he was, uh, he was uh, Drake. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, so you saw Avatar too. Yes, I have. Yeah. I bet you Avatar 2 didn't want to see that one, did you? What would you think? What do you think about cuz I haven't seen Avatar 2. I don't know anything uh, about the movie. I know nothing about Avatar 2. I've not seen Avatar 2. I've not seen the first 30 minutes uh on some weird website uh that I went on uh, anyway. Uh I I I don't know anything about because Avatar Bluefield 2. would never torrent wet movies. He would never pirate I would never movies. torrent. I would never torrent. Torrenting is for the the evil. Remember, kids, piracy is wrong. Who is this Always watch or respect Excuse you? Are you gonna are you gonna <laughs> stand up for that disrespect that just got thrown at you like a baseball bat? Just fucking throwing Where? a baseball bat at you? Ugh, oh, how's it going? Was... It was great. Um I'm really enjoying this knife you got me for Christmas. I don't know why you stabbed it into me, but thanks for the knife. I would never stab anyone. Really? Really? I, I go along with your bits, but you don't go along with I my I wouldn't bits. stab okay. someone. I would shoot them. That That is true. That's a fair point. 
Well, it's that is a fair point. Uh, anyway, yeah. So, uh, tell us about yeah. Just tell us your general thoughts about Avatar Two, while I uh, yeah, while I message someone back that I forgot to message. Yeah, just, yeah. Well, uh, hey, what? Hey, what did you think about Avatar Two? Well, should have came out fifteen years ago. Oh, yeah, you got your wisdom tooth taken out, bro. Ooh, fuck. Wait, please tell me it was all four and not just the one. Oh, that's a Do not really... tell me you only got just the one out. You better have got all four out at once or else you're just going to be repeating the same yeah. amount of pain over yeah, and that... over again. God, that's pro... Well, I mean, I hate getting my wisdom teeth taken out. I I've had my was I had my wisdom teeth taken out and it was I'll I'll be honest it was not that bad, it really wasn't that bad but maybe it was just the dentist uh that well I don't know if it was dentist but like, uh I don't know if it was just the dentist that I went to or if my whole thing but like my wisdom teeth got, if it just wasn't that bad for me, just because I I don't know but like Bruh, for me it really was not that bad like the so. worst part honestly was me getting like sick from the painkillers and like. Uh, my jaw was really sore. Uh, it was just, I'm 27 and one came in. Actual surgery wasn't that bad. The tooth coming out was fucking agonizing. Wait, what? Wait, what do you mean? Wait, the actual surgery wasn't bad at all. The tooth come. Oh, the tooth coming in was fucking agonizing. Yeah. yeah. Cause, okay. Cause okay. That you makes don't sense. always yeah. have to get them out. Sometimes the wisdom teeth won't cause any problems, but, but yeah, no. So, like, okay, honestly, the one thing that was annoying for me was that the doctor didn't sew up my holes. He just took out the teeth, didn't sew up the hole. Like, none of them. And I know, like, some cases where, like, if the holes are small, you don't need to sew it up. But, like, it felt like you need to sew this up. Like, bro. All right, guys, so here's a little challenge to the stream, okay? I'm going to be, so, like, you know, talking about Avatar 2 without spoiling anything, okay? But for every time Bluey over here dies, I will spoil. No! So, Bluey, uh. don't die. Fuck. Any, oh, oh, yeah, damn, I wonder uh, if I have stitches in my mouth law. I was so fucking out of uh, on Xanax for the operation. Um, I know that one thing that uh, my, my friend had his wisdom teeth taken out recently, and they used these stitches that, like, kind of dissolve almost. Like, he didn't have to go oh, back yeah, and have them taken out. Yeah, I heard of those stitches. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know much about the, uh, hold on. Let me get the video game going anyways. Yeah. So I, I mean, gen just like general thoughts on avatar two, like what were, I love how we call it avatar two. It's not like avatar two isn't even in the name of the film. It's just avatar, the way of water. It's not no, but like, so we just call it that as a, a substitute. <laughs> yeah. So like what, what were your overall thoughts on the film? Like what, like is your overall, uh, take on the film more negative or more positive because you know i've been seeing a lot of Def like you know normies basically saying like oh you know it's all right or it's pretty good uh no offense to people that you know but um seeing a lot of reviewers and stuff saying that you know yeah it's it looks really good like as a uh, technical standpoint i think it's very top mm -hmm. quality but from a story yeah. and writing standpoint, there's not really much there. That's what I've been hearing. So I was I was curious as and to what your overall thoughts on the film were. That's not completely far off from what's actually happening. Like, in terms of story, it's nothing groundbreaking in terms of storytelling wise. I mean, if anything, if you ask me, in terms of craft wise, as a story, it's technically worse than the first one when it comes to storytelling wise. Cause really, the first. Let me explain, because the first movie, Jake actually had a real character arc. <laughs> the second movie, not so much. Jake is going through, like, the same character. He's the same character that he is 
at the from the beginning of the movie to the very end of the movie. He's Wait a still minute. the same guy. You're calling like, me Mrs. Discord? Oh my god. Aw, oh, dude, we're gonna have to fucking punish you later. Hold on, sorry, I had to I had to address that. You Mrs. Might be Discord? To me. Oh my god. <laughs> Mrs. Discord. I'm gonna Mrs. give you a Mrs. Discord. But um Yeah, you you, you think from a yeah, it's like, I, I mean, I think the the whole world of Pandora, oh, not the world of Pandora, but like, I mean, the world of Avatar, world I should thing. say, does, ha I mean, I guess, yeah, Pandora, but like, the whole world was, uh, like, the world building and everything was pretty good, and... Oh, it's um, still top notch. It's still top notch to this day. It's still great. But like, I feel like one of the big appeals, me, and one of the, one of the reasons... GF. At, wait, sorry, who's the big man with you? Oh, sorry, um... Yeah, this is, uh, I'm, I'm yeah, this is him. But yeah, so, like, one of the big appeals that I felt like with Avatar 1 was that it was just this weird, like, oddball, groundbreaking blockbuster film with, like, you know, it, it had all the CGI, it had, ooh, the alien world, it had all the, like, CGI blue people, it had, um, yeah. the crazy visuals, it had all, all that kind of stuff, and it's kind of like, well, are you just trying I'm to do that again? Gear. Pretty and much, legit. That's pretty much it. like that, and like the really dated political messaging. But um, I won't get into that until Bluefield dies, because like I said, no spoilers till he dies. Go yeah, ahead, Bluey. and I, 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 I haven't seen the film. Spoiled. I haven't seen the film, but I know some of the stuff that happens in it. I, I know some of the uh, weird messaging and that kind of stuff. Like, not, I don't know if propaganda, I mean, it, technically, it, I mean, would you call, like, general political okay. messaging like that propaganda? Because, I, I mean, mean propaganda... Go from a broad stance, then yes, but no, it's, I wouldn't say this is propaganda. I wouldn't say this is, trust me, even though, yeah, it is a little, like, I guess it is in the category of woke, but not like 2020, 2022 woke. More like 2013. Like environmentalism, kind of. Well, like, there's a lot of environmentalism and that kind of old, stuff. Well, to be fair, there was a lot of that in the, in the first movie, too. Yeah, but, but I, I would never, like, I would never call the. Then? I wouldn't call the first film, like, woke or whatever. It's like, there's a difference between, you know, being like an MCU well, film. Well, to be and, fair, and, that's mostly because what's considered woke then isn't really woke now. I get what yeah, you it's mean. Like, yeah. It's often with, like, like, say when you, like, even when you watch, like, say, Dune. Why are we mid-rolling again? What do you mean? Dude, mid-rolling is amazing. Dude, look at that. Look how fast I am. Just Look at that. Oh, oh yeah, Dune. Like, people were... I, I don't know. Um, so, with Dune, it was counterculture back when it was written. Back in, like, the 60s and shit. But yeah. it's not the 60s anymore. It's, like, it's no longer counterculture. It's the establishment. This is, like, what's here now. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, I get what you mean. Yeah. Is he just so fat he can't light roll? Dude, I'm I'm, I'm really skinny. I, dude, I'm so skinny that if I was standing right in front of you, you wouldn't be able to see me. And it's not embarrassing. It's a it's a tool. It's a tool that I use to That's destroy my enemies. Part of uh, the Last Airbender was way better of an Avatar movie. Wait, what? The Last oh, Airbender was. was a way better. Oh, yeah. Wait, whoa! Greatest. Not the <laughs> Avatar movie. <laughs> <laughs> the, the Avatar the Last Airbender movie. Yeah. We don't talk about the live action Avatar movie. Oh, God. Uh, oh. <laughs> there is no uh, there is no live action Avatar in Boxing Say. Yeah. I mean, um Dude, Yeah, but so so fire. like like messaging like pro like whatever, like pro culture, anti what what what, did, what was the term that you used, I'm sorry? Um, I was using counterculture. Yeah, counterculture. Like aside from that what did like? What did you think of the the overall story and the writing? Overall and the story is and not stuff? that bad. It's okay. I mean, yeah, dialogue was a bit mid at times, but it wasn't horrible, as people are saying, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Um, <laughs> my nice Shamalama Ding Dong <laughs> makes oh the goodness. best Avatar movies. Dude, what if oh, M Night Shyamalan made? Avatar, like the these, like the uh, Avatar films, like the not. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! It'd be terrible. It'd that'd be, be that'd be a funny little. That'd be it'd funny. It'd be funny. You know? it, it, just let let him write the robot chicken parody. Just let him write the robot chicken parody. <laughs> but um, yeah. So I mean, what are the best tasting politics? Oh my god. What are best? <laughs> 
Dark Soul The one. best tasting mm -hmm. politics. The bad guys would just die The bad die guys from would die from yeah, is, hold on, is, is the water yeah, in, on Pandora, is it H2O? Like, if humans went in it, would they be I mean, is it salt water? Is it fresh water? Is it like... Well, it's can I not drink acid. It all? It's not acid water, I'll tell you that. The reason I say that is because, well, we have humans getting stuck in water, but they don't die. Mm -hmm. But they don't, but they're wearing the masks, you know, the oxygen masks. Oh, God. Which, here's my question. Okay, so there's a character in the movie called Spider Guys. Spider is supposed to be this human adopted son of Sully. Yeah. Okay. Don't don't, don't say, like, who he is, though. Like, don't say his uh, backstory. Uh, that, I've already, <laughs> I just gave him the baseline stuff. This is what you yeah. find out in the tra trailers, okay? Here's the thing. So he wears this oxygen mask because, you know, Pandoran air isn't, you know, it's toxic to humans. This mask never... Ever breaks. Never breaks. There is never a crack in the glass. There's nothing. This kid never accidentally falls off. Nothing. This kid will fall from like 12 stories. He should be dead from that. Yeah, fall. he'll go through Doom but Eternal on will... like Nightmare and it'll be totally fine. Exactly. And the mask never takes any damage, never kills him. Right. It makes no sense. That's that's so. Funny. Like, I, I, I find that I, I just how. I find that so funny. Honestly, it's just like it's so dumb. God, like um, I I know one part of the movie. I will say uh, this isn't really too much of spoilers, but where he gets like kind of fucked up, and it's like uh -huh. he he looks messed up. It's like oh wow, I wouldn't want to be him right now. And then it's like oh his but his mask is totally fine, <laughs> not a not a scratch on there, and it's just properly on, on his face. It's like. So, so his, just his entire life now on Pandora, he wears I that fall fucking thing. Th like every Sunday, and I'm not dead. Well, there are humans still on Pandora with him that help him out and shit. That because the reason he was on Pandora as this young is because when they were sending humans back, he was a baby. You can't exactly put a baby in, in a spaceship. Yeah. Except for Superman, he's the only exception. But, you know, yeah, you know, so you know the character from the original movie where it was like the nerdy scientist one? guy, um, yeah. who's like Jake's friend. I thought, yeah. I thought that was good. I thought that was him, but like I didn't remember what he looked like. So I was like, oh, maybe he. Oh no, oh, I forgot that to pick wasn't that him. Up. I was like, but oh, also, maybe like, he, he beefed up avatar. a lot. Yeah, no, yeah, no, he had. A, well, he's is he in the film? I don't remember. I think he might be there, but okay, if that he means is, he's not. not a lot of the main Amer not a lot of the main human characters are in the movie as much as the other ones are. So they basically just forget about him. Yeah. Well, yeah, because they're mostly hanging out and um with the water tribe. Yes, I will be referring to the Give water all people that in this water movie pussy. as the water tribe. Deal with it. Because I'm not going to. I can't remember the names. I don't. Yeah. Overall, I... this like visually speaking, this movie was good. Story wise, eh, could have been a lot right. better. Could have been better. There were some parts that was kind of dumb, but overall, um, it's not a bad movie. It's if you go watch it, you're probably gonna have fun. I don't see you not enjoying something in this movie. I don't believe it's a waste of your money. So, yeah. One definitely thing, go see it. It's definitely good, but not great. One thing it that I... It should have came out yeah. 13 years ago. Yeah, it's just... Like, one thing that uh, I saw a lot of people complimenting about the movie is that it has a strong, like, father character where that's, like, it's nowhere to be seen in Hollywood now. That's, I thought that was interesting because yeah, it's, like... That is a good... Like, I mean, here's the thing. If you think about it, that's not even an impressive... Like, if you... Okay, here's yeah. the worst part. If you went back... If, if I were to tell you five years ago and I was praising Avatar for having a strong rail, like, a, like the main ma male character is a father who's just trying to do everything to keep his family alive. And I was praising that. Back then, if I told you this, like, five, like, you know, ten, ten years ago, you would have told me, um, GF, 
What do you mean? That's a lot of characters. That's normal for male characters who are a father and stuff. They care about their family. Yeah, so nowadays, not unique at all. Nowadays, we don't get characters like that anymore. Now, it's gotten to the point where a shift in our, like, storytelling culture, that is, not to want to go full, not to go full socio-political here, but it's not, we're not even close to that anymore, to the point where, like, that is now unique. You know what I mean? Yeah, you, know what I mean? you don't, you don't see really strong, strange. you don't really see a whole lot of, like, strong father characters in movies, and, like, yeah, especially, where it's, it's, like, like strong man thing. family It's the fact that he's movies. a father yeah. also, like. And it's, like, about a family, because, you, you know, he has Natiri, who's his wife, he has the kids, he has the adopted yeah, kids, the and so, like, they're all trying to look after each other, and it's, like, oh, you know, this is a strong family film, and it's, like, you don't really see too much of that anymore. Yeah. Um, which, oh I mean, my oh, God. TV I'm shows in the weak. past always have the weak, bumbling fathers. Yeah, except Jake's not a weak, bumbling father. He's actually capable and actually does something. Yeah, Hollywood but. definitely. They, they they see. Yeah, it's like there's um. Is that a light roll? Like one of the last like good father characters I can really think of was um well, actually recently was uh Viserys from House of the Dragon, but like. Also, uh, Ned Stark from Game of Thrones. You know him just... Uh... Still need to read that. <laughs> Sorry, wait, what happened? Uh, is that a light roll? Um, it, well, you know what they say... Oh, no, is this the Bed of Chaos? Yeah, this is... Uh... So you know what they say about the Bed of Chaos. Let's see. Um, yeah, I mean... Oh, man. Yeah, my neck is really tight. Bloody cross, how's it going, dude? Um, I don't need, yeah, so, you need me to rub it. So the wait, sorry. I said you need me to rub it. Wait, I. I, I forgot neck, what I said. Dumbass, your neck. Oh no, 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 no! Keep those fingers to yourself. Um, yeah. So Aww. like, everybody's saying that the battles in this film are like you know like fucking massive or like uh, not massive but like really really good are there any battles yeah, like on par with the final battle in um, um avatar one if not honestly, i'm gonna be so fucking disappointed uh now that you make me yeah you asked me that i actually wasn't asking my i actually wasn't asking this question when i was watching in theaters and i'm thinking going back no, unfortunately, not as massive as the Are final battle. Are you serious? That's, that's a shame. That is retarded. That is fantastic. so dumb. Yeah, it's no. like literally one of the whole, like the whole point of Avatar, like the whole shtick of Avatar was, you know, the big battles and the big, like, ooh, like the visuals and everything. It's like, whoa, pretty movie. It's like, you're, you're not even going to have a battle as large as what was in the original. Like, that's cr that's insane to me. That's insane in the member. <gasps> Don't get me wrong. There are some cool fight scenes and stuff in this movie. There are. But it does not come nearly as close as the final battle in the first movie. Yeah. And also, I do need to say this. I, I do need to say this. Like, I'm not the kind of person to where, uh, you know, like, I'm only half joking. Because it's like, I'm not the kind of person to where I'm like, I want a bunch of battles in a film. You know, like, I'm not really... This boss is so fucking retarded. Um, I don't really care about that stuff. Like, whenever I watch a movie or a TV show or read a book, uh... I very much care more about like the actual story and everything more than the spectacle. Uh, like, you know, one of my favorite shows is, uh, if not my favorite show is Legend of the Galactic Heroes. And I love it. I love that show so much because it's really, really damn interesting and all the characters are awesome. Um, so it's like, I'm, I'm just not really that kind of person that watches movies, TV shows, all that kind of stuff uh, for like big, like awesome battles anymore. Like, yeah, those are fun and those are cool to look at. But in my opinion, what makes a good piece, uh, like what makes a good story, is you know the good characters, the interesting plot, uh, having it make sense, having it feel real. And so it's like if a story, like a movie specifically, um, in this case, if it doesn't have like you know interesting characters, a cohesive, well-defined, well-thought-out plot, then there's not there really going to be anything there for me. Um, it's like yeah. okay, well. Like, yeah, the battles are visually interesting or whatever, but I just don't give a shit about them because I'm not invested in the story. 
Like at that point, it's just right. flashing lights on the screen. Um, but like, yeah. What's the point of that? Well, you know what they say. Who the fuck Ollie, is this new guy? It, he's not a new am. guy. He's been here longer than you. Excuse I've you been very here before. much. Ugh. Yeah, he's been <coughs> he's been here before. I don't think you guys. It it was a very brief stream. It was only like an hour. It was, uh, it was a really was doing, brief stream, and I wasn't prepared for it. <laughs> doing broken oh, straight. I was shitty that time. Yeah, he is Sandra. Who the fuck is Sandra? Yeah, I'm Sandra. Apparently, they want to call me Sandra now. Sexy fart ASMR. What? Uh, Blue really be talking in an ASMR voice, only to scream at the top of his lungs, waking everyone else in the house. <laughs> I never do that. I have never done. Oh my god, you're so full of shit. I have never have, done that in my life. You have. Shut the no, fuck up. No. You Stop you harassing your lungs me. Out once. Stop harassing me. Oh, only this game's one bullshit, damage. Dude. Wait, you're lying. You have. Are you an African oh, cat? Because you're a lion. Oh, this is the guy we had a three-way with me and Bluey X. I'm gonna fucking yeah. like. I'm gonna back this game up over with my car. I swear to God, that's such. Hey, bullshit. I told you. The second you die, I spoil. Apart from Avatar, the um, the way of water. All right, it has to be a minor spoiler though. It has to be something hey. small. All right, go. One of Jake's kids died. Oh, that's way too big of a spoiler. What the fuck? Hold on. I never promised God anything. God damn it! Buddy. Don't. Yeah. No. 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 Don't. Don't say some. Okay. Don't. Don't do big spoilers like that. Like that's way too fucking much. God damn it, dude. All right. All right. God, I'm an asshole. I'm an asshole. Um. God damn it! Now. Oh, I'm gonna. Ooh, you're. You really shouldn't have died. Right now. You shouldn't have died. I'm just saying. Oh, really I'm about to die. I'm I about to you. kick you. I told you damn. what happens if you die. I, I said you. a minor spoiler. That's not a minor spoiler. <laughs> God, I mean, caveman. the kid's a minor. The kid is a minor, so. Well, you we don't. I don't know that. Are you an African? I, I said, are you an African cat? Because you're a lion. Oh, you're trying. What? Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck is going on here? Blue See, isn't this. Context is best. Bluefield out of context is best. Bluefield. Change my mind. Everyone dies at some Everyone point. Dies at That's some point. That's not true. That is not true. <laughs> I will never fucking die. Don't ever say that in my wanna... presence again. Bluey, Peasant. you want to take Jesus. a fucking bet? Everyone spoil Avatar for him. Once, one sec. Where's my oh shotgun my rack on stream? <laughs> I don't have a shotgun. I, I talked to Bluefield on the, the phone, bit. guys. Uh, bet you guys. Are... You did not talk to me on the phone. I don't even have a phone, so there. <laughs> How yes, about those do. nuts? Wait, what's what's he doing? Or what's hey, she so doing? Hey, so does Instagram let you say your pronouns as D's oh, nuts and does nuts fuck yet? Off. No, it doesn't. I I hate Instagram. It like uh <laughs> It's like, oh, they they claim to be so inclusive of all whatever, but it's like whenever I try to put my own custom pronouns, they're like, "No, no, no." And it's like I I can't have more than 4. Like, fuck you, dude. Fuck you, Instagram. Bigots. God. Well, I think the whole four thing is they that literally would have like because I know some people that have the pronouns set as like for for example she her hers and I can't remember the last one. I, I want all the pronouns. <laughs> I want to be the I most really powerful care. man on Twitter. But hey, in order to get into the in order to become a <laughs> in order to get into Hollywood, you have to have seven. <laughs> yeah, you know what they say. These nuts. No. Wait, is that all you had to do to beat the boss? Yeah, this is, this is known as one of the worst bosses in the series. Are you shitting me? Uh, Are you shitting me? That's how easy that was? It's actually my brother a really hard Christ. boss. Because she like, constantly knocks you into her holes. and like Yeah, we'll, we'll do a better boss. Oh, then. that's any woman. Huh? Knock, knocking you into her holes. Oh, God, you're going to make me <laughs> Fucking vomit. Good. <laughs> Anyways, I got the sunlight maggot so I can go down into the area where it's very, very dark. Uh, all the avatars have gay sex orgy. Uh, are you inside the bed of chaos? It's colon. You know what? Well, actually, uh, I, I saw this video talking about Dark Souls 2, like connections between Dark Souls 1 and Dark Souls 2. And in Dark Souls 2, the, uh, what is it? The Lost Center? 
in her eye, in her eye hole, in her her eye hole, you can see the bug from the bed of chaos, like the little bug, of, uh, bed of chaos bug crawling around in there, especially in the cutscene. So, uh, I don't know. I thought that like a lot of people were saying like, oh, she's a remnant. And, I mean, she is a remnant of bed of chaos or whatever. You know, she drops the uh, old witch soul in New Game Plus. I, I don't think that was supposed to be like a direct correlation though the bug i think that was just a reused asset that they were like oh people probably won't remember this but of course it's dark souls so everybody remembered it uh she constantly knocks uh oh what the fuck women are always so uh women are always so womanish i swear what the fuck am i doing holy shit in the heck dude my god uh anyway yeah so talk more about don't give any more fucking spoilers um <laughs> for uh, avatar avatar 2 so yeah, like okay. so one thing i will say is i really do like the um i really do like the new details put in for like the new characters and stuff especially like the water tribe they have some really cool features that are like not even the same with um oh you mean like they're oh like how their tails are finned in their uh -huh. Hey, Bluefield, I thought we didn't have this conversation before. <laughs> yeah, we we didn't we didn't have this conversation right before the stream and then we decided totally to didn't talk have, about it during the totally stream. We totally weren't talking for an hour before yeah, we decided to go we on stream. We weren't doing trying that. Trying to recreate that said conversation. Who is actually watched Who's actually watched Avatar? I've seen the first one. The dumbass you're forced to listen to. This guy has seen both of them. I haven't seen the next I haven't seen Avatar 2 yet because I don't want to go to the th to the movie theater because uh Bluefield want to hear a joke? No. I don't. I kind of comes more like uh I hear D's it. No okay. I like to hear the joke. Wait, is chat slower on your end? Uh, on your end? Well, you I have I have live I chat on. I have live chat on, which shows every single message. But if you're on top chat, it only shows like certain messages. I don't really know how it works. Okay, but you can switch I'm doing in between. Top chat. Live chat. There we go. Uh, Sandra, spoil Avatar for me. I don't have the money to watch it. They fight the sky <laughs> people. Again, they fight the sky crew. That, uh, five bucks to whoever gets that reference. Um, <laughs> I actually, you know, th this isn't really a spoiler because, you know, they talked about this all over the place. But um, mm -hmm. the main villain is actually the colonel from uh, the first film. Mm -hmm. And uh, what they did is they cloned his memory. So, like, actually, the film does a lot of this stuff to where, uh, like, because, you know, I, I already know some of this stuff. I, don't, I didn't really care too much about all the spoilers, you know, because I was just listening from him. But... What this film does is, it's like, oh, yeah, this stuff happened during the time of the first film, but they're just make like, it didn't actually happen then. They're just making it up for the, the sequel. So, like, in the first, like during the, the time Wars. of the first film, they cloned their, like, main sol their their top soldiers' personalities, including the colonel, and then they, when they returned to Pandora uh, at the time of this film, Avatar 2, they put their uh, memories into Avatar bodies. Um, and I actually, I think that's a pretty, it's actually not a very original idea, actually, because there are a lot of science fiction things that have done that. Like uh, Starcraft actually did enough. that with uh, Legacy of the Void, where the Protoss had like massive archives of their best warriors that were like put into the bodies of uh, robot soldier guys. Um, but it's still so it's still a really cool clock, idea clock though. <laughs> Sorry? Sorry. Wait, I'm no, I didn't hear comments. what you said. Hey, he didn't because um they're asking why you and I broke up cuz you wouldn't give me the Glock Glock 9000. No, I wouldn't share my twin Glocks. I still won't. I'm going to get them in the custody hearings. No. I mean, the judge no. will side with me. It's not going to happen. Look, I think what I think what you need is actually I can't make that joke. Um, <laughs> never mind. Uh, ow! He took one health. God, that fucking hurt. Why is the delay so big on the? It's only supposed to be seven seconds. 
And I still haven't gotten... Okay, well, now, just now I got hit by the... Uh... Bluefield's getting less funny each stream. Okay, Damn. that's just... Jokes, lard nice, ass. I don't watch your streams that often. <laughs> lard ass? Bro, I'll show you some fucking lard. Motherfucker, I'm fatter than Bluefield, actually, I think so. I'm not... What? Unless you bulked up, bro. No, I'm actually, I'm actually, uh, the lightest that I've been in a very, very long time. Oh, damn, alright. Yeah. Um, but, uh, Bluefield is getting less funny each stream. God makes some jokes, lard ass. Yeah, you want to hear a joke? Yes. Okay, how, here, here, yeah, here's a joke, a joke for you. What's the difference, what's the difference between jelly and jam? You don't jelly your dick down my throat. No, no, you weren't supposed to answer. You were supposed to say, I don't know, Bluefield. What is the answer to that? No, so I don't you can know, do it again. Bluefield. What is the answer for that? The difference between jelly and jam is that I can't jelly my dick in your ass. You also can't jam your <coughs> sham it in there either. Okay, this is all right. You don't well, have one. This is now now this is being this is not a funny stream. <laughs> Um, ow, fuck <laughs> me, god damn it. It's funny for um, me. It's not, it's not. Uh, it's just pretty Sandra's funny, pretty thank you, funny. Ollie, I, I don't know about ya. that. Have you ever eaten human grease before? Wait! Stop. Human grease. Oh, god, stop talking about human grease. I'll fucking give you some human <laughs> grease. You, you don't even know the, the meaning of human grease until you've met me, IRL. Uh, <laughs> Sandra's actually funny. You don't know that Sandra, <laughs> wait. Bluefield's actually kind of hotter than Sandra. That's true. That is true. <laughs> kind of hotter. That's not true. That's not true. Yeah, it is. Um. Yeah, <laughs> Alright, time to fight this uh, boss from the video game. Oh boy, don't die. Don't die again. Nah, I, don't I'm not gonna, if die. I die to this boss, I think I might, like... I I'm kidding. I'm not going to spoil. If I die to this boss, then uh, you can have the five barrels of um, what? It, what? What is it? Yeah, chicken pot pie insides that I have in my cupboard right now. Oh god, he's gonna fucking climax. <laughs> Speaking of climax, oh yeah, there's a lot yeah, of yeah, uh, yeah. like weird alien sex stuff in Avatar, isn't there? Oh yeah, they have like a full like have like a full orgy at the end. Even the colonel the colonel joins in. Oh god. Yeah, they they well, Eiffel Tower Natiri. Well, I don't even know what that means, but you know what they say? Ignorance. There's one one guy's in the back, the other guy's in, is in the front of her, and they're high fiving over over top of her. Ew. I thought I wasn't gonna explain that to you on stream. How much you human grease does Bluefield? Dude, I, dude, I, I, I consume. No, I, I produce more than I consume. I'll just say that much. All right, this boss is dead. Um, type one, two. <laughs> no, 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 no. Stop, 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 Wait, stop, 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 stop. What's one, two, five, four? Wait, what's that? I don't know. It's just some random fucking number. So um, just being <laughs> you know, actually, you can come into this room beforehand for like a special covenant, uh, and he's just like sitting there in his coffin. Ooh, that's some souls right there. Okay, hold on, let me just put put that all into dexterity, so I can get a lot of damage on this thing. Uh, oh, excuse me. Um, so yeah, I mean, what I've been seeing a lot from uh, reviewers is stuff like this film should have come. Th it, it, this film should have been released like, a few years after the original Avatar. Do you think it would have been more yes. successful or less successful if it came more out? More successful. More? Ten times more successful. Definitely. It would yeah. have gotten, um... I mean, I think that's... Wait, yeah. hold up. <laughs> Sandra and, um, Bluefield both say a joke. The winner gets Bluefield's channel. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> I do not accept. I do not accept <laughs> that. <laughs> Watch this, I'm gonna murder this woman right here out of anger. Out of You're anger, I'm gonna. Bitch, you won't. God. Who's on with the knife? Who's on with the knife? I just killed a woman on stream. I know what men are capable of when they're angry. I'm still alive, dipshit. Hmm? I'm still alive. I've never, I've never been angry once in my life. How about you grab this dip? No. <laughs> Would you grab this dip? I have a feeling you are a grob. 
Yeah, what you don't didn't hey, know that uh, hey, Mario wait, wait. Mario how's your how's your uh, uh, night or morning or afternoon going? Hold on, let me get let me get these guys right here. So um, yeah, what else I guess with uh, Avatar two? Um, I don't know. Was the soundtrack memorable at all? <laughs> There's a soundtrack. <laughs> I forgot about a soundtrack. Yeah, I, could, I, I can definitely see the soundtrack of this film being, like, very much more of the same of the first film, but also, I guess. Uh, like, just... Sandra's woo! funnier than Teak. Like, like, okay, I'll majestic, accept that. Like, majestic uh, wildlife music that's in the back of every, like, documentary mm -hmm. or whatever. Um, yes, Aaron, that. how's it going, Aaron? Yeah, see, and Mr. See, he he. If Aaron can call me Mr. YouTube, then everybody here can call me Mr. YouTube. Like, I I don't like that you guys don't call me Mr. YouTube. I find that very. I call you Mrs. YouTube. No, 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 no. Tandra fifty percent. Uh, Bluefield five percent. Teak forty five. What are you talking about? <laughs> what? I think he's talking about how funny I am. Anyway, Blue. So I was actually talking to Wendy recently. What? Who is Sandra? Wow, Sandra, this dick. <laughs> That's what uh, they're calling me. They think I'm Sandra. Oh, oh, I, I literally. Me Sandra oh now. my god, I literally was like, who the fuck is Sandra? I was looking through chat. I was you like, didn't know? who is Sandra? That's what they're calling me now. Sandra? Why Sandra? I don't know. It's I'm like just a going bastardized version of Cassandra. Is Sandra and Teak have an affair that led to the downfall of Blue to Sandra and Wildlife is my favorite That led to the downfall of Bluefield's sex life. <laughs> yes, that's exactly what happened. Did you beat the Dark Souls 2 Broken Straight Sword run? Kinda. Like, I mean, I did some DLC stuff, and I also uh, beat most of the game. Like, I got to the throne, Watcher and Defender, and Chandra at the very end, but, like, I didn't... Uh, I didn't kill Vendrick. Well, I didn't. I, I mean, I didn't kill them either. Uh, I'm like right at the end of the game, you know. So, oh my God, these motherfuckers need to get the heck away from me right now. Um. But yeah. Oh, what the fuck is that damage? Did someone just post a leak to the Quran in in in, in chat right now? Wait, what? Oh yeah, I think he did. <laughs> <laughs> I'm to allow Habibi. <laughs> oh boy, that <coughs> that was a good dodge right there. Oh no, I'm gonna have to lose one humanity. If, uh, well, I mean, I can just go get it again. It doesn't really matter. Ow! One sec, I take care of my dog real quick. Oh, okay. Anyways, though, yeah, uh, I didn't even realize you guys were calling. Yeah, because I, I haven't really been focusing on the chat all that much. I was just, uh, we were mainly just talking about Avatar 2, so I was like, who the fuck is Sandra? <laughs> uh, go racist on those crystal motherfuckers. Yeah, no, I, I, I hate crystal people. I hate crystal people. Like, uh, I'm oh, not even no. joking. Is, is I am racist against the Chris. Like, I'm racist is against. Is Bluefield ranting about Steven Universe fans again? Oh, God. <laughs> Steven Universe? Dude, I, I don't even want to watch. Like, I, I, have you seen ER's review for that? E semicolon R? I, I don't think so. Honestly, bro, I've seen, like, I think I've seen, like, one episode of Steven Universe when I, like, when, when it was airing on Cartoon Network once. Mm -hmm. And, like, eh, it was alright. Like, I didn't hate it. Like, it wasn't, like, cringe. It was, I, like, I didn't see any. I, yeah. I can understand where the cringy fan base can come from. I know exactly where it's from. But, yeah, no, I know where the cringy fan base comes from. But, in terms of the show, I don't know much, like, series. People. It just then seems again, like. I've only seen one episode. That's it. It seemed, it looked, like, from what I've seen, it just, I, I wouldn't like it at all. I mean, fair, I mean, I'm not yeah, really into yeah, kids' shows it's that not much. The show but it's not for you. It is what it is. It's just not the show for you. That's all. Yeah, but still, it's like even though it's not, I'm not the target audience. It's like just because I don't like it doesn't mean that it's still good. You know, like even though I'm not the target oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. audience. No, 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 no. I'm think, not saying yeah, that at all. I'm not true. saying it is good. I don't know anything about it. I literally don't know crap. So that's crystals. That's it. The crystal and, gems. Uh, go. Crystals and lesbians. That's all I know about the show. That's it. But, um, oh god. 
I'm not dying fast enough. Okay, Blue there we field, go. What do you think of the Quran verse that says that Muhammad had sucked on the tongue of What? Tongues of boys. Read the chat, please. Isn't Steven Universe, like, really popular as well? Yeah. That's kind of worrisome. Alright, right, time for another spoiler. No, Nothing. no, 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 stop, 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 that's the, that, no, 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 stop, that's a, that's a, that's a death that's supposed to happen, like, you can't progress in the game without that. That's not a real death, that's not a real death. Okay, but first off, I wasn't going to spoil. No. Because, like I said, I was done with that. No. I don't believe. You think I trust you, you slithery little salamander? Yeah, and I didn't trust you, you said you weren't sleeping with Sophie, but guess what? You still were. Who the fuck is Sophie? Exactly. You don't even remember her name. Yeah, she wasn't. Yeah. Anyways. Um. Literally the most kitty show. This gain is greatness. <laughs> oh God, that doesn't stun him. Oh, okay. Well, two hits does, but one hit. Nah, he's he's okay. I apologize for yelling. <laughs> Anyways, on a scale of 1 to 10, how funny is my rating? Oh, you're like a negative 11. No. You're like talking with no. a brick. You're, you're lying. You're, you're, just, like li you're just lying. Brick. You're just lying. You're like lying. There's, no, we have, a, we have a rule on this show. No fucking lying. That's literally the mean? number one show. The no gaslighting, no lying, no <laughs> anything. Oh my god, what here not. we go again saying like gaslighting. No gaslighting. How many times Dude, have I gaslighted? There is no yeah. such thing as gaslighting on the show. Like it will not. I will not stand for it. Well, that's because Jack. That's because gaslighting doesn't exist. Wrong. Like gaslighting is not real. You made it up, Bluey. Like you come made. On, man. What the fuck? Well, I mean, <laughs> well, if I made up a whole concept, <laughs> that makes me like, kind of. Like Ali, there's no such thing as gaslighting. It doesn't exist. Like. I don't know where these rumors came from. Gaslighting doesn't exist. Do not spell the N word in chat. Do don't not. do it. Don't don't do it. Do not, do not, don't, Jesus don't, Christ. do not. Do not spell the N word. I'm Fucking begging little you. hexters, God. God. Little goddamn motherfuckers. Your honor, my, goddamn my client lookers. couldn't possibly predicted what the chat would have spelled out. What Fucking the chat silly billies. After he posted N. Y'all are a bunch of silly billies. SEALED! Sorry, that was really- that was too loud. That was too loud. <laughs> that, that was, was way too loud, wasn't it? Nah, that's fine. They just keep- they're just trying to spell the N-word. Oh my god. No, don't fucking grab me. Okay. Well, um... What would you- life. so, like, I know that... Sometimes, you know, uh, uh, scaling scores can be kind of weird because it's like, you know, maybe the movie is really good at this, but it's not. Like, what on a scale of 1 to 10, what would you give Avatar 2? Uh, I'd give it a, uh, like a high 7. Like, really? It's not, a, it's not a bad movie. It's not. Like, it genuinely... Like, okay, keep in mind, a five for me in terms of movies is, like, a movie I'll watch if I'm bored. You know what I mean? Do, so, do you, like... Well, because I would consider five to be, like, average. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So, like, five average for, for so you... So, five as well. or six, then, for me, I guess. Really? Okay. Yeah. That's actually a lot more generous than, like, a lot of, uh... Yeah, because overall, this isn't a bad movie. It's not. It's much better than all the other shits we put out later this year. But overall, not a bad movie. I thought it was good. I didn't think it was groundbreaking or, or did anything different. But overall, this is a good movie. It's not bad. Yeah, I just... uh, won't... <laughs> Yeah, I, I mean, that's kind of unrelated. I'll bring that up later. But um, I don't know. It's like... Do people even really care? Like, it, it seems like James Cameron makes... He wants Avatar to be his legacy. Like, this is what he wants to be. Yeah. Like, the, the thing that when, like, people think... You know, because, like, uh, directors, writers, they always have that one IP that they wrote or made or whatever that is what people think of when they think of them. So, like, with George R. R. Martin, they pe people think of uh, Game of Thrones. When people yeah. think of uh, Robert Kirkman, I think his name is... Uh, 
you, you know, yeah. people think of the, the Walking Dead. Right. So, like, people, like, I think James Cameron wants people to think of Avatar when they think of him. Like, he wants Avatar to be the next Star Wars or MCU or whatever. Um, and it's like, that's fine. But one thing that's just, and I understand that there were technical problems with Avatar 2, like, trying to film and everything. Like, it really did kind of take a long time to properly do his vision justice of this whole underwater epic. But... I don't know. It's like the thing is, is that if you're going to make me wait for a sequel for like 13 years, the story better be fucking awesome. It better be I like I want I, I wanted this movie to be awesome, like with its story. Uh, I wanted a drama. I wanted the first part to an epic series. And from what everyone's been telling me, from what you've been telling me, it is not that at all. And, it's it's um, not like it tries to be that. It most definitely tries to be that. Uh huh. And like, uh, it's not as epic. And you know what he's doing is like he he's been like Avatar three is pretty much almost done. If it I, is yeah, like he he like Avatar three is all filmed, and then Avatar uh, four is like almost done pretty much. Because uh, <coughs> and the reason as to why is because. You know the kids are still important characters, and he didn't want them to age severely as the film went on. But it's like they're they're also CGI, so it's not. Yeah, it wouldn't to be, be as fair, like, like Sigourney Weaver's one of his kids. The woman's sixty, and they based her character model off of when she was a teenager. So you really don't need to worry about characters age, like actors aging and shit. Mhm. Mm well. Oh shit! Right, yeah, I can't get down. I was just checking. Oh my god! Fucking move! Holy shit! Sorry. Um, but yeah, it's like I I wanted. I don't know. Like I still need to see the film, but I I can make an educated guess as to what I think about the film before I see it. Uh, like in terms of what I'll probably think of it. Um, you know, it's like I I can make an educated guess as to whether or not I would like She Hulk. <laughs> But um, I don't know. Oh, From what everyone's been telling me, Avatar Two oh, isn't God. what I really wanted it to be. Um, am I? Hold on. God, she Hulk Wait, what so the hell bad. is wrong with me? Wait, what? D didn't I just do? Oh. Sorry, I, I I was completely immersed in the conversation and I wasn't paying attention to what I was doing. Did I just? I don't know, dude. What I'll the? Play dark sense. Okay, but um, yeah, it's like. Are you interested in a... And, and also, okay, I'm sorry. I, I got cut off there. But yeah, so Avatar 3 is almost pretty much almost done. Avatar 4, uh, like, I know the filming is, like, pretty much... Underway. Yeah, well, done, almost done, I think. And then there's Avatar 5, which was also announced. Like... Why a fifth one? It, he he it. wants this to be his epic series. He wants this to be the next big thing. He wants Avatar to be as like legendary as Star Wars or It would have been if he would have released these movies years ago. Well, see, I see like the thing is that I actually don't really agree with that because like well, as long as the story be... as long as the sequel itself is still like fantastic and it still like makes sense and everything. The story's good. The, the movie itself is well crafted. Then, I think it's fine. But it's like if it's just going to be more of the exact same. Only it's like oh, instead of th them flying all over the place, they're swimming, and it's like th the story really isn't anything special. Then, yeah, it's like, but wh why should why should we all be invested in this series? If he's not going to put his all into the actual storytelling, into the characters, into, into making this into something that right. we're not just going to remember as something that was really pretty on screen, but something that was memorable in terms of its plot, its characters, the events that took place. Um, but, yeah, that's just what I was... Yeah, that's just something I was thinking about. Um, no, I get what you mean. Because I, I really wanted this film to be like, like, I wanted it to blow people away. Like, I was, I desperately wanted to, like, when I heard that there were uh, reviewers talking about Avatar, 
I was like, oh my god, please have people saying it. Like, obviously they're critics, so they're probably all paid off. But I just, I desperately wanted people saying that the film itself was good, as well as the story, that the story was really good. And as soon as I started seeing what people were saying, it's like, oh yeah, it's magnificently beautiful film. Oh, the visuals are insane. I, I immediately knew that the story was going to be bad because it's it just the just the way that they were complimenting the film only talking about the visuals it was yeah and then and then you know there were some critics that uh oh my god that's why i didn't do fuck i'm sorry i look I, I haven't for those of you watching i haven't played this game in a while so i kind of forgot to turn that wheel over there um but yeah, that's <laughs> why. Hold on, what, what are they saying? Leave so you can talk to each other. Are we non-existent? Read the chat, you ball, you ball sacks. I'm, uh, dude. What? That's you're the guest. That you're, <laughs> you're the one supposed the to read the people. So unless they become the enemy and humans are the heroes, I hope the franchise dies. Yeah. Yeah. The whole the whole thing about making humans like evil or whatever is retarded it's like yeah it's so basically like the world is not black and white it's very like there's a gray area to everything and like we all know jake's the actual bad guy in the first movie because the dude wouldn't do his fucking job his job is to assimilate into the navi and explain to them why humanity's there so they can get the resources to survive but no he just goes fucks natiri and yeah i do suck at reading chat deal with it Um. Timed out, but what? Why were? Why, wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa! Why did you time them out? Give me a reason. Oh shit! There's a bunch of people. Hold on. Uh, I need to get out of here. What are you got? What is going on? Why are you guys? <laughs> why are you guys spamming in chat? Okay, I'll actually, I actually will time you out if you spam. It's because I'm not funny. reading the chat. Oh that's my god, why. fucking fucking baby ass. Dude They're mad at me because I don't read the chat. As often Goddamn as they like me dirty too. diaper baby ass fuckers! I swear. How this happened? It's like, oh, you didn't read my chat? Yeah, I didn't read it on purpose. Little slimesicle, fucking slimy popsicle. Jesus. Um. Anyways. What happened? That's right. We're gonna we're gonna cuss out the the chat. Drops that the this n word. Looks. That's right, I'm not reading everything in the chat. Grob said, I'm not reading that. Go Grob said, he oh, oh, he said that? Oh, that's I have a very important message. Please read. No, don't read it. Oh, shit. Yeah, he said over. Hitler is back. Oh, God. <laughs> World War II, two. two. That'd be pretty interesting. Blue, what's your opinion on the Jewish question? What? I don't know. I'm just reading the chat. Wait, Hitler I'm isn't black? Not, I'm taking you not reading the I chat think personally. <laughs> the chat personally? I'm standing Hitler. up right now as well, so it's like the chat is several feet away from me and I can't read. So... I, I literally can't read, so even if um, even Sorry. if I was close to the chat, I couldn't read it. Uh, how did that happen? Sorry, I had Rob, a tab out for a second. Rob said because... the N-word. Did he actually? Bluefield, can you tell or are you us just making the that funny up? joke you told us to say Sandra? Is this a funny joke you told us to say to Sandra? What? I'm it's not reading the latest Hitler comment, guys. Don't listen to Stop. anything that they say. They're, they're all, all they do is gaslight. Literally all they're good Dude, for. Dude, There's a bunch of hexters. Exist. Oh bunch of fucking God. hexters. Um, gaslighting doesn't exist. The real Mr. YouTube reads the chat. Bro, I'm reading the I chat. Can't. I just read your chat, dude. Uh, I can't Rob didn't read. say anything. Blue. I literally can't read Bluefield. What? I I literally, dude. If you put text in front of me, I am not going to be able to read it. That's just how it is. If you don't like it, slurp it up, big guy. Cause that, yeah. Uh, Grob didn't say anything. Wait, what are you talking? I'll think you're more than blue. Ever. I don't know about that. Um, realize gaslighting realize and talking gaslighting about Jews isn't and cool. Talking about Jews. 
motherfucker, I'm not talking about Jews. Yeah, let's not talk about what? No one's <laughs> talking about Jews. We were talking about Avatar. You avatard. My that was God. pretty funny. That was pretty I hate, funny. I hate you. No. That joke was stupid. What do you mean it was stupid? Oh, you're stupid? It was stupid. Oh, what the fuck is going on here? Okay, never mind. Um, I'm, I'm calling you out for your stupid joke. I'm calling you out for your stupid joke. How are you walking in the middle of the air? Because I'm goddamn Bluefield. How the fuck do you think? That makes Name sense. Name one thing I can't do. Well, and you excel can't at. please me. There is literally no exercise that I can do that's you under 135 pounds. Um... Look, I think you're blaming the gay undertones of the stream on me, and I just want to say I have nothing against that. I have nothing against being gay. I'm just, I'm not gay myself. So, Sandra, if you want to lay off the gas pedal real quick, <laughs> that'd be real sweet of you. Oh, now you start referring to me as Sandra. Okay. <laughs> we'll just call you Sandra for now. Yeah, we some we should. You, you should know, change, yeah, your change name. my name. <gasps> oh god, wait, no, no, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want. Fuck, oh, god, dude. Never mind. I'll do it myself. All Give right. me a second. I'll do. I'll, I'll do a spoiler for Avatar too. I was joking. I wasn't gonna spoil it anymore. I'll do. Uh, it'll be a very small spoiler. All right. What's your spoiler? <sighs> The humans lose a battle in the in the film at some point. No. Yes way. By the no. way, that was a great uh, Pornhub stream you did last night. Excuse oh, you. Thanks. Wait, is this the? Wait, which one is the? Uh... All right, I did it. I changed my name in the Discord to Sandra. Dennis Merson, take the resources. Uh, Bluefield, you really showed me where Uranus was in space last stream. Oh no, that's that's too in no, that's that's inappropriate. Don't don't say like inappropriate stuff on stream, because then what happens is that I I, I that read your chats, I read your inappropriate chats, and then it's forever immortalized on here. Uh, Grob is back. Grob is back. Uh, who will do it next? Take no on someone. I am. I am returned. <laughs> I got you. Oh, God, my fucking kidney up. hurts. Stop, stop timing out Grob. You goddamn cavemen. Jesus. Hey, Blue, you Literally, what play, did you do? Um, you want to play some Halo, multi Halo Infinite multiplayer with me? No. Okay. <laughs> How long have we been straight? An hour? Oh my God, there's no way it's been an hour. It's been a, yeah, it's been an hour. Has it actually been at Jesus? Felt yeah. like thirty minutes. Yeah, it's literally been over an hour. Is you, if your kidney hurts, can uh, you can uh, whoa, fuck! I was reading chat and I didn't. Uh, I'm not gonna read the rest of that chat because it gave me like bad luck. It made me like almost fall. Um, can you read it for me, Sandra? Oh, which one? Hey, Something Bluefield, about a kidney. If your kidney hurts. Can I give you mine? No, if your kidney hurts, can I give you mine? If your kidney hurts, I can suck it. <laughs> it's been an hour of pure shit in chat. Yeah. Yeah, you're all a bunch of shitters. Yes. I'd rather I'd rather have a bunch of truthers than liars. So like, if you guys could start stop the gaslighting and start the gas, uh, gas darkening. Yeah. As opposed to gaslighting. Gas dampening. I'm gonna dampen that fire. Or wait, what is the fish? Like, I'm gonna dampen that fire. No, no, <laughs> I don't know. Um, actually, I don't. I don't even need any of these because it's like I already have a plus fifteen weapon. Um, similarity between uh, a guitarist and you. Um, guitarist get I, laid. How do you know I'm not a guitarist? A guitarist. I know for a fact you're not. Like a I, guitarist. I mean, yeah, I have a boogity. But, I mean a Bugatti. But, yeah, I know some people don't like fucking booby. Like, oh God. Um. Mo Lester is a really good actor in TBF in Avatar. What? So stupid. I don't even know what's. I don't even know what the hell you just. I looked at that. I'm like, what?
Oh, uh, what's blue? What is the similarity between Bluefield and a guitarist? Okay, they well, both well. like fingering minors. That's insanely inappropriate. Hold on, you can't even hear me on the microphone. Uh, if you ever say something like that again, you're gonna get in big fucking trouble. Okay, we don't need to see this. <laughs> I'm just reading the chat, bro. I'm just no, 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 not job. you, not you. The person in chat who said that. Oh shit! Actually, I I got turned around here. They both like fingering minors. No, because I, I I like majors better. Check Discord, maybe. Maybe you I'm have wrong. to give me some incentive to check Discord. You know, it's like, like you can't just you say check like... Discord and expect me to check Discord because it's like, what's in it for me? What's in it for me, Sandra? Uh, I don't know. Sandra, if you rat on me, you are a little bitch. I'm not ratting on you at all. I ain't doing shit, mofo. I like fingering Sandra. Now that's fucking inappropriate. Because you don't. Oh, sorry. I thought I was saying Blue likes fingering me. No, he doesn't. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> I don't even know. All right, let, let, let's let's think of something to talk about. Um, mm -hmm. okay. um why don't you? Uh, no moonlight greatsword. No, I, no one has time for that. Uh, also, I forgot. Um, look at God. Look how much fucking damage I do. Jeez, I do a lot of damage actually. Um. Yeah, I may as well go do the... Oh, I need... Oh, actually, no, I have enough souls, I think. I have enough souls to where I could buy the key, go fight Sif, and then get the ring, fight the four kings. Um, This is the moment your chat snaps. No, I don't think so. I don't think so, Buster Brown. I don't think so. What's the difference between hey, Bluefield and a gaslighting crazy person? Everything. I am not a gaslighting crazy person. I have never robbed any banks. I have never uh, committed any hate crimes. I've, I haven't done anything, okay? You guys are accusing me and accusing me and accusing me and accusing me. And I, I shall not stand for it anymore. I shall not stand for it anymore. Uh, can I show you my PP blue? No, you cannot. Um, hey, Bluefield, can I show you a card trick live? No, you cannot. Hey, how about this? How about this? Joe Actually, Biden is in the Discord right now. Joe Biden is in the Discord right now. <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. Um, One sec, let me find it. <laughs> God. Serious question, because I am not seeing any difference. Dude! Oh my God, the, the slander that I... See, the slander that I'm being... A, that I'm a victim of right now is just ridiculously insane. Recoculously insane. Oh my God, if I die to these fucking idiots again... I am gonna... No, no, away from me, away from me, away, 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 stop, 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 okay. <laughs> oh, they're not coming! They're not coming in here, okay. Like, in some ways, the movement in Dark Souls 2 is actually uh, better than in Dark Souls 1 because, uh, you know, you, you have, uh, like, omnidirectional rolling when you're locked on. But in other ways, it's just so much clunkier. But, uh, anyways, what was I going to... Uh, Joe is grooming me, guys, help. <laughs> um, don't time him... If, and whoever times him out is going to get demodded. Guys, don't time him out Grob. Yeah, don't don't time He's him good. out. You're going to get He's in trouble. He's a good noodle. You're Grob is a good make noodle. make Bluefield mad. You don't want to make Bluefield mad, do you? That's not something you want to do. Um, nope. Yeah, what should we... Oh, I, you know, I actually don't need this. This is uh, like the Evangelion rebuild or Shinji track tracks that pranks the soldier boy. What do you What do you think of the Evangelion rebuilds? Oh, dude, I gotta rewatch them sometime. I do. Because honestly, I actually liked them. Don't get me wrong, they did do some parts, like, from the original bad. Like, yeah, I'll admit, Asuka's character is by no means, like, as horrible. good as she's developed in the original but i do believe there are some characters that are developed much better in the rebuilds than they are in the original who like ray 
Ray is ten times better in the rebuilds than she is in the original. No joke. Uh... Especially the the clone of Ray. Like the look like Ray, she actually has a character arc as opposed to the clone in the show, in the original. I'm not saying it's a. I'm not saying the rebuilds are 100 percent better. I'm just saying the yeah. rebuilds do do some aspects much better than the original did. And actually, yes, wait, Misato doing? is always hot. Everybody knows that. I mean, hell, I wish I was. Hell, I wish I was Shinji. I wish I was Shinji during the um, end of Evangelion, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Uh, I say I want to jack off over Asuka in her sleep. Oh god, that's like the worst thing. <laughs> um, no, I mean I I honestly don't care for them. Like uh, I don't I don't I don't even there. Like I can't really name anything that I like more about the rebuilds. Like there are some things to where it's like, oh yeah, this battle was made to be a bit more visually interesting. Like um. Like, in the first film... I guess, like, the first film is probably the one I like the most. Oh, yeah. But, uh... And the second, the second one was good, too. I think my favorite part in the entire bit is, um... Like, one of my favorite parts has to be when Shinji basically goes berserk with Ava Uno's, you know, Unit 1. And oh, fighting the angel to... that, like, breaks into the base. No, fighting the angel that um, kills Ray, and so he's fighting to pull her back. Wait, oh, oh, you, you mean know? the weird, uh, the Halo the Ring one? one? I think so. Wait, I are you talking know, about I... the original or the the new the, rebuild? The rebuild. rebuild. Okay. I, I don't remember. I don't remember that, so I can't really speak on it. But um, I I don't know. Like like some things, you know, were were cool. I guess where it was like, oh, this is basically just like the same shot from the original, only it looks really cool. It looks it looks better or whatever it looked like better animation. It's Honestly, like, man, whoa, the battle with Raniel was so awesome. You and I should awesome. rewatch. You and I should rewatch it and actually do it. To, you you and I should rewatch it. Rewatch them. I don't know if I want and to. then do another stream talking about it to actually get. Yeah, better. I mean, we could we could do that. I I don't know. I, Yo, See, let's like, watch them on stream. <laughs> it's just nah, I don't I don't really care about them though. That's the thing is that nah, because nah, I, I love the the story of Evangelion. I I mm -hmm. think if what they did is if it was the same story only, they expanded upon certain things more and like the exactly. ending. Exactly, because like, like, like it Shinji's like with Kaoru, being an asshole is Kaoru, better explained in this than the original. Kaoru should have been in the show more near the end. I think they they oh, didn't yeah. do him justice, but um. Uh, I don't, I don't like the story nearly as much. Like, it just kind of feels like, I don't know. Like, who, who's the new, the new girl that did the I whole, can't remember her name. I fucking like, hated again, her. She dude, was stupid fair, as fuck. Like, she did not, not need to be I in that. It's not because I didn't hate her. Film. It's because I just don't remember names easily. Yeah, like, That's the girl. The I forget names. The girl with the glasses. Like, you had, in I my know opinion, you, you had the, the best the cast of, like, you had a really good cast of characters. You had... Uh, dad, Sh uh, Shinji's dad, you had Shinji mm -hmm. himself, you had Asuka, you had Rei, you had Misato, and then you had, um, the doctor. I can't remember her name right now. I'm sorry, but, like... I can't remember her name either. Those, those six characters are, were, like, Dr. you know, the, the main oh, six no. characters. And then, you know, of course, there was the deputy commander as well, but, um... Ayo, hey, Berserker, it's nice. It was a really good cast of characters. It's like I don't really understand why they added her in. It's like what what is it that she added to the story? I don't know either. I yeah, she didn't remember. add anything. She was just there I I to just be like a, the, the funny anime character. I haven't seen the character. movies in over a year. I haven't seen the movies in over a year, so I can't give yeah. you an answer. Actually, this isn't me trying to defend her. No, no, no. I'm saying I just like can't as give a any criticism. Yeah, but but like, oh god, I don't know she was so annoying in the last film as well, in the fourth one. Where constantly when she was talking to Asuka, she's like, all right, wait, what did she call it? Like, princess? I think it was princess, right? It, she was so I don't know, obnoxious. but it, she was definitely given a lot of, um... She was given Asuka a lot of fuck me eyes at times. Yeah, she was just not a character that I enjoyed. Also, her. here's the funny thing. Here's the funny thing. Hmm. Guess what? Even got all Asuka and Ray simps, you're welcome 
they are net because of the rebuilds. They are finally legal. Y'all are no longer purrs. <laughs> because in the rebuilds, they're all adults, but they still look like teenagers because they're frozen in time. <laughs> Oh, I God. gotta love anime bullshit. That was right. So, I, I thought that was so dumb, honestly. Like it's like they just because of the curse wanted, of the Ava, I look like a little because, girl forever. It's like that's so epic. <laughs> Don't worry. They wanted to make all the damn um. They wanted to make all the damn like hentai weebs. They wanted to justify them just from that. It's like so where are you going besides jail? <laughs> it's so stupid. Um. Uh, so, okay, actually, the funny thing is, all right, so. One of the two main, sh like, you know, ships in terms of the shipping fandom with um, Evangelion mm -hmm. is like, oh, who do you ship more, Asuka, Asuka and Shinji, or Shinji with Rei? And I say, guys, reject the false dichotomy. It's Shinji and Misato. Moving on. Um, yeah. <laughs> Oh, right. Shinji and his dad. For legal better. reasons, that's a joke. Anyway, um... He's actually a 300-year-old dragon. I know, I... <laughs> no! Bro, these two don't even notice chat. No, wrong. I just read two chats right there, and I'll read a third one. Right now, end it. I read it. Uh, because of you the know. curse of the Ava, the older guys who live in their mom's basement can jack off to me. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> uh, we could all ban Grab 988 times you wouldn't notice. Wrong. I, I would. would. Notice. Wait, did you ban him again? Hold on, if you banned him again, I'm gonna get really ooh mad. Hold, stop. Wait, hold on. Oh, wait, hold on. Who timed him out? If, if they ban Grub, I will attempt to sing the Avengers. Ali, you intro. timed him out. All right, you're getting unmodded for the for the rest of the stream. For the rest of the stream, you're unmodded. Nope, I warned you. <laughs> He's been unmodded. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Hello, you Coke fucking nerd. Coke and Ollie. Yeah, now you can't. Whoever, yeah, whoever bans him next is going to get their uh, mod taken away. Uh, also, who banned Grob? Not P's back. Uh, Cat, how's it going? Uh, Ollie banned Grob. Yeah, they're being very, very meme. Oh, for the rest of the stream? You think I care? I think you do. If you didn't care, you wouldn't be messaging me this many times. Um... Uh. Anyways, though, what Ollie was timed out. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I've created a fucking war. This is a mess. I've created a monster. <laughs> <coughs> Anyways, um, what was I gonna do? Oh, right. I need to go to wait. Yeah, I'm gonna perish. Okay, so now Ali's been timed out. Oh my god. Nobody bans Grob but me. True. Anyways, yeah, we were talking about um Evangelion the rebuild film. I mean, you I think you said something one time you were like, Oh, I like the ending to the rebuild films more than the original or whatever. Yeah. Well like Yeah, listen, I did. You know why? Because the rebuild ending doesn't make me reach for an entire bottle of Advil like the like the original uh, did. Yeah. I mean the thing is is that the rebuilds felt very flashy and weird just for the sake of being very flashy and weird. Um, I, the original felt very genuine and very... Uh, I, I guess that's one of the... That's the best word that I would use to describe Evangelion. Like I the original the real, series, very genuine. I feel like maybe the ending of the rebuild movies isn't better... Yeah, I feel I, like it's probably I don't like no, 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 no. Let me finish. I think it's probably more comprehensible compared mm -hmm. to the original. You yeah. get what I mean? Yeah. L like the like the the rebuild one goes for a more, even though trust me, it still has its heavily convoluted metaphors and bullshit in there, like the original did. Oh, okay. It's most. I'll read your comment in a second. It's but it goes for a more unpalatable route compared to the original. Anyway, yeah. hey Sandra, what is the one topic that will make Bluefield so angry he won't read chat to realize I banned Grob? <laughs> Don't bring up Teletubbies Bluefield, around can me. you tell me why men can't be women? Oh no. Oh, no, no, oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh no. No politics. Anyway, anyways though, um... But yeah, so like the thing about the rebuilds... 
Oh, man. Like, the third one... There, there, there are things that I like about the rebuild. Like, the thing is, is that... If the rebuilds existed by themselves in, like, the original... This game's fucking... Oh, my God. Um, if the original series, like, was never made or whatever, if that makes sense, I think I would be yeah. more sympathetic to the rebuilds. But if it was the original Evangelion and not, and if the original didn't exist. I, I actually, I saw someone saying like, oh, well, the rebuilds are what the original was supposed to be, but they didn't have the time to make it. I'm like, did you even watch the original? No. Like, what? That's crazy no, to me that people said that. I'll prove to you why they aren't. Do you know the reason why the last two episodes of the TV show were so confusing? Why? It's because the author, the original director, had no fucking clue how to end the series. He didn't have a concrete ending for the series. Is that actually true? I thought it. Well, I yeah. mean, it obviously had. Uh, it obviously also had some to do with the uh, the time constraint that they had for, like. That too, I think episodes, so. That they had a time constraint too, but I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, like, I, I mean, with the last two episodes, the uh, animation quality, obviously, you know. They definitely went more artsy than uniform. Bluefield, do you think if you like Evangelion so much, you have to watch the rebuilds no. or read the manga? No, just watch the show. Nothing else matters. Yeah, just watch the show, guys. You don't really need... Cause here's the thing, well, Evangelion has a fuck ton of spin-offs. Yeah, it does. Like, like, watch, hold on, I'm sorry, watch the show, uh, watch the original Neon Genesis Evangelion, and then watch the end of Evangelion. You don't have to see anything else. Like, I don't, like, you don't, like, I, I've heard from people that the manga is pretty good, and I have read some parts of the manga, and I thought that it was pretty decent, like some of the changes that they made, some of the things that they added on to. I don't like some of the stuff that they have, though. It like I, I don't I don't know. Like the thing is, is that I don't, I don't. I'm probably not explaining this that well, but stop timing out, Grob guys. I, Leave I don't alone. I don't like the rebuilds nearly as much because whenever I watch those films, I feel like it's trying to be artsy and weird and convoluted, just because it wants to be artsy, weird, and convoluted. That's what I see when watching um, Original Evangelion. <laughs> and also, it's like it's trying to kind of cash in on the weirdness of the original. It's I, like, oh well, I don't Evangelion think that's the always case. been this weird. And there's, it's like, no, it has it. Like the the weirdness and the like the storytelling style of the original is nothing like the rebuilds. Um, I don't. I also actually, well, I won't get into that. Nothing matters anymore. <laughs> Hi, oh. not really. Hey, Vickers, how's it going, dude? Sorry, yeah, I, I actually haven't been reading chat. I, I am sorry. Um, time out, Grob? No. You're not no. time out, Grob. Leave him be. Where is Grob? Probably timed out. That's where he is, probably. Because they keep timing him out. Okay, now he's back. What do you mean? Who the fuck are you? Cat, who the fuck are you to time me out? Cat can do whatever... Wait, hold on. I would bring... Bang Freya? Oh, hello, lady. Right, I have to go get the... Pe oh, my goodness gracious. All um, right, Che, who's funnier, me or Bluefield? Look, I think there are a lot of really cool ideas in the rebuilds, and there are... Like, when you know, when I watch those, I'm like, yeah, this is visually really interesting. But there's also just a lot of stuff that they don't properly explain, and they're like, oh, it's... It's like, oh, it's Evangelion. It doesn't have to be explained. It's supposed to be ambiguous. Yeah, it kind of does. Weird. And, um, uh, yeah, there's just a lot of that, just a lot of convoluted nonsense just for the sake of being convoluted nonsense. When, even though the original series and the end of Evangelion is hard, it, it can be hard to understand what's going on, but I never got the Extremely. feeling of, as to like, oh, this is just bullshit, or oh, this is just artsy to be artsy, or oh, this is like... That's what I was getting the whole time, though, for me. Like, I was really confused by it. But then again, maybe I just need to rewatch the original series with End of Evangelion. I probably need to rewatch all of this bullshit. I I've seen That's it. probably what I need to do. I need to rewatch all of it. Yeah, I, I mean, do I've you have seen on this? Neon Genesis like 20 times. I know. I know, but I've only seen it once, and I've only seen the rebuilds once. 
Wait, where was I? Okay, there we go. Um, yeah, I've only seen the rebuilds once as well. But um, yeah, why did it, the fourth film? It took so long to make. Like, yeah, I don't know why that? it took so long. Huh? I don't know, man. I don't know. Yeah. I also, I also don't like, like, I think, um, one of the angels that they added into the series, into the rebuilds, looked cool, and it was the weird clock one that was, like, walking on water. I'm that was at the remember. very beginning of the second film that Asuka kills. I thought that one was, like, okay, that maybe could fit into the original, but there's another weird one at the very beginning of the second rebuild to where it looked, it had, it, its visual style was, it, you would not have seen something like that in, uh, the original series and so it's like when you have all that stuff like the visual styles kind of clash with each other because for the most part there's a lot of stuff in the rebuilds that's pretty much copy and paste from neon genesis so it's like okay are you gonna just copy and it's like you can't just copy and paste some things and then completely change others because it, it just has that weird uh creative technical clash um yeah and by the way grob Triple A definitely tastes better than double A batteries. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? Why they is every me. Wait, Ollie just got <laughs> uh Ollie, aren't you blue? Uh oh, I timed him out for the rest of the stream because he timed out Ollie. Bro, oh, sorry. No, 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 he timed out Grob for it. Sorry, I got Ollie and Grob mixed up. Oh, that's gonna go down really badly. Um Yeah, I mean, yeah. What else can we talk about, though? Um, I am not capping Grob. Triple A tastes better than double A. What is? No, uh, it does not, oh man. Come God. on, I eat hey. batteries for a living, bro. Sandra, remember AAA. that massive countdown for Berserk that was on their website? That was supposed to be a huge deal. I and it just yeah. What out was to, that about? And then it just turned out to oh, sorry. What was that about? I don't know. Oh, you d oh, sh okay. Well, I, I thought you would know about that, but it was a huge no, countdown on their website. About the countdown, but I didn't know what the countdown was for. Oh, well, it turned out to just be like a Blu-ray release of the uh, Golden Ark trilogy films. Bruh. Oh, <laughs> I like, thought it was oh, going to be wait, like... Did you actually watch the um, memorial edition of the of the... Golden Age films that came out recently. No, I, I don't. I don't know I really what they are. What did so they like add anything? What it is, so basically, what they did was they re-released the three movies, but as an like as a twenty-minute anime episode format. So oh. it's it's, it's it's as a TV show, but they also added in and reanimated scenes that weren't in the movie originally. Like the scene with Guts and Casca talking in the campfire, that's in the series. Oh. But that wasn't in the uh, the um, first three movies. It was in, in those the three movies. It was in the manga, you mean? Or? That was in the manga and in the 97 anime, but it oh. wasn't in the 2013 movies. Did we're they... not talking about Trump's NFTs. Fuck oh, off. God. What, what, what else do they add? Is it like a I... lot or is it only like five There's minutes? a lot of stuff that was added in. I don't know because I didn't watch it. Oh. I'll, have to I'll have to watch it, but I don't know what else they added in. But they added in an absolute banger ending song. Like for the credits oh. song. Fantastic. It's good. I actually, now I, I want to watch that. The, the memorial edition. I want to watch that now. Yo, let's watch it on stream. I'm kidding. Okay, stop stop timing each other out. <laughs> they, Jesus. They wait, Grob got timed out again. No. Uh, materi Oh, wait. Yeah, no, that was Grob. I'm sorry. <laughs> Um. Oh my God, Sealed, stop! Fucking spamming in chat. God, I feel like I'm babysitting. Never mind. Um. <laughs> uh. You are babysitting. Though. Where was I gonna go? Yeah, Undead Paris. Uh, Undead Paris, <laughs> not Undead Paris. Um. No, that's cool. I, I'm sure they didn't add in. There's no chance that they added in. Um. Uh, why old, right? What's that? Why old from Berserk? Is that the group of people without chasing? That's the tongue dick guy, yeah. Oh, him? Oh, no, I think they added him. What? Wait, whoa, hold on. I'm going to look that up. I think so, but I'm not sure. Hold on. Um... Uh... Oh, oh, I 
I spelled it wrong. Uh, okay, Memorial Edition. Did they add him in? I don't see anything for why old. I don't know. Again, I have to watch it. I haven't seen it. But look up the ending song. It's good. Yeah, I'll look it up after the stream. Yeah, it's called Wish. Yeah, it's a good song. I don't know. I, I kind of like the, the somber. I, is it like a somber song or like what oh, yeah. kind of? Very yeah, okay. somber. Yeah, because I, I, I love the Definitely ending to the third the film, even though, you know, it's like they never really. Co I mean, they kind of continued it with the 2016 series, but, you know, that was uh -huh. Garbo. Uh, oh, you know what? I could have. I have the ring for the abyss, so like I could go do. Uh, no, I'd rather do the DLC right now. Um, Did you brought your father with you, Mr. YouTube? Mrs. YouTube. No, this is not my father. Excuse you very much, Vicus. Just kidding. Um, this is actually Sandra. Sandra, meet Vicus. Say hi to Vicus. Hey, sexy. No. <laughs> I'm gonna get you banned, bro. I'm gonna get you banned. It's gonna be hilarious. I'm gonna get myself banned at some point. At some point. It's the old I trusted you. Yeah, you really did give him the ban hammer there, really tough like. You really just kinda mm, jammed it in there. <laughs> Sandra Bullock. <sighs> Well, what what is what's something that we can talk about that uh, won't get us banned? That's that's not many things. Uh, just like I don't know, some TV show or whatever that we both. All right, um, let's talk about Kenobi. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> all right. Remember all when right, I said right. in the Discord to you, I was like, it, Episode three was fantastic. I. I didn't. Uh, I didn't actually mean that. Like I was trying to do a sarcastic thing, but I wasn't really. In yeah, the position I think to, I went yeah, crazy that, on you because that was a shitty episode. God, I I, I haven't Bro, finished. Bro, that wasn't even the it. worst episode. The episode when um, when when uh, you know Leia gets captured by what's her face, Riva, Riva. and she's interrogating Riva. Okay, that episode is the worst episode of the entire series, and I'll explain why. The dumbest thing that happens is when Vader's trying to choke her out, it's about to kill her. She goes, wait, stop. I know where she is. I, I have a tracker on her ship. I'm going, Riva, stop, 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 stop. You don't need a tracker to put on the ship because you know where they're going. Do you know why we know where she's going? Because Leia told her that she is... Princess Leia Organa of Alderaan. Yeah. Tell me, where would Obi Wan Kenobi take Princess Leia of, of Alderaan, Alderaan after rescuing her? What well, man, I'm you... really wondering where in the galaxy would he take Princess Leia of Alderaan to after rescuing her? Like, yeah, it's just I really it's such can't... like I'm sorry. Whoever wrote Can that you series... point to where she? Well, I'm like Dora. I'm like oh. Dora up in this bitch, going. Can you show me where he take Princess Leia of Alderaan? Click. That's right, Alderaan. It's who, whoever wrote that series is not nearly as smart as they think they are. Like it, it's just. God, I couldn't. I couldn't believe how bad it was. Like Book of Boba Fett was bad, but I, I oh, managed yeah. to actually watch through the whole thing. K uh, K Kenobi, I couldn't get three episodes. Uh, like I stopped. Kenobi, episode three, I watched I the whole done. bit. Don't get me wrong. Kenobi has some good stuff in it. It does. Like the final fight scene between him and Vader. It's great. Mm -hmm. It is good. It like seriously. In the second like he cuts open Vader's helmet, we hear a mix of. Hayden Christensen and James Earl Jones's voice. Yeah, that I, I saw that on it, YouTube. And that was pretty cool. That was just fantastic. And, but the one thing that made me cringe in that last scene is where he goes, "Fine, I guess my friend's truly dead. Goodbye, Darth." And I'm going, "No, no, no, no! You stop right there. Do not try fixing George Lucas's mistake." And what I mean by his mistake is, all right, tell me. 
Blue, think back to when, um, you know, in Episode 4, when Vader and Obi-Wan are fighting. What does Obi-Wan always call Vader throughout the entire fight scene? Darth. Darth. Do you know why? Because back then, when George Lucas was, didn't even write Episode 5 and 6, throughout the end, throughout that whole time, mm -hmm. that was Darth Vader's name. Yeah. First name Darth, last name Vader. That's on his birth certificate. Darth Vader. Darth wasn't a Sith title. It was the man's given name. And, yeah. It's so stupid. Yeah, I mean, the thing is... So, like, some people uh, try to defend the uh, sequel trilogy and say, like, Oh, well, the original trilogy wasn't planned to be a, a, a trilogy. Like, he made the first film, and he didn't know he was going to make any more. Well, it's like, it, but yeah, that's the thing, is that Actually, he didn't know A New Hope more. is a self-contained story. It didn't have a sequel in, in mind when he was making that. Like, it wasn't designed to, like, it didn't end on some fucking stupid, retarded cliffhanger. It didn't add all these unnecessary things into the story that will never be answered or that well, oh they'll be answered later on in the series, but not now. You they did it, it, but it wasn't as tongue in cheek as other C series. It was like do weird it. world building stuff that could be added upon if the time came, but it wasn't an incomplete story. Like the like episode seven is fully an incomplete story, and it's oh, made yeah. to be the first part of the story. A new hope is not a a new hope is a self contained a self contained story that has sequels. That's the difference between the original series. That is true. But here's and... the thing, though, with a new hope. Oh wait. Tell me, what is a new hope called? Episode what order? It's episode four. Yeah, but here's the thing: when George Lucas he didn't know that. released, yeah, no, 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 no. Let me finish. No. When Star Wars: A New Hope was released in theaters, when the title crawl show up that showed up back in 1970 something, it was called A New Hope. And now episode four. Even Star before, yeah. yeah, and I would know because my like my dad he'd tell me this stuff because he literally went to see Star Wars, like when it originally came out. He he knows this. Sandra, how long is it, is Bluefield's cock? Yeah, it was called Star Wars: A New Hope. Episode set, episode four, yeah. No, episode four wasn't in the title when it first came yes, out. Yes, it was. No. Well, it wasn't in the title, but it's in the it's in the title scroll. Yeah, it was. That's that true. wasn't something he went back and added in. That's actually was originally there when they first came out. Bro, just go to any like. No. Just, just, okay, we're gonna yeah. we're gonna skip this. But um. All right. Well, they're asking how big your cock is. So you want to answer that? Uh, like seventeen. Um. Seventeen centimeters. No, seventeen <laughs> meters. That's why it takes me so long to pee. But anyways, though, so, oh god, yeah, Kenobi. Um, Kenobi. I mean, what would you Kenobi. rate Kenobi out of a? What would you rate Kenobi on a scale uh, of one to ten? Honestly, better than the Book of Boba Fett. Book of like honestly, no, 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 no. dude, no. Book of Boba Fett's boring as fuck. Yeah, but so is Literally, Kenobi. What? The They're only both boring fun, as fuck. No, the only fun thing about Book of Boba Fett is when they decide to go, you know what, fuck it, this is season three of The Mandalorian. Yeah, but the writing is even worse, though. Like, oh my god, in Kenobi, both of the... I could not believe, in episode one, like, uh, uh, the running away that Leia w was doing from those guys. <laughs> and then in the so second funny. episode fall, when she's running away from peppers. Kenobi, I was like, this is the dumbest... Po this is the dumbest show... I have ever seen in my life. Whoever wrote this is an idiot. I honestly okay. was thinking, like, uh, no, honestly, whoever wrote that is a fucking idiot. Like, yeah, it was no, it so is. goddamn will, bad, yeah. so cringy, so just nonsensical. It's like, you can't, it, like, and also the reason for Leia running as well, she's like, he, he, she sees Obi Wan using the Force, and it's like, what? what? Yeah. Okay. Can I, I say know. something? It, it was like well, hold okay, on. Wait, wait, I do wait. try to look because this thing I do try to look at some of the positives of the show, and one of the positives I can say that I actually did like is I'll be honest, I actually kind of did like the, the the kid they hired to be young Leia. She really did I mean, yeah, actually. She was fine. 
she did bring back she did bring a lot of the Carrie Fisher charm that Carrie Fisher had back in the role. They did a good job grabbing her, instead of getting her. They never read chat lol, Sandra's a bad guest. What are you talking about? I read chat all the time. They're mad they're just mad because Teak does literally nothing but read chat. And so they're just, they, they feel like, never mind, just just ignore them. They're being little hexters right now. They're being He's really goddamn greedy. Sandra really likes goddamn the greedy. Sandra likes the, oh my god, fuck you, Grob. What are they saying? They're saying I like kids because I said I liked the kid they hired. Yeah, they joke They joke about that. They call me, like, pedo. No, I should have seen that coming. Yeah, but, um... There's a lot of things I should have seen coming. Batch of Bow Wow, but come on. <laughs> I wish Kenobi had never left Tatooine. Well, actually, I don't wish... I, I wish the show was never made in the first place, honestly. Um, I mean, I wish the show was different. Yeah, I yeah. wish the show I mean, was made, what but it was say. what we deserved. If the show was not what we deserved, it's the fans. Yeah, like, I wish it was just Kenobi on Tatooine. Teak's better than Bluefield. That is true. No, is that's not true. Okay, we're fighting. Oh my god, how the fuck did that mess? Whoops, I'm being a little hexter right now. Uh oh. Yeah, well, I mean, um, I don't know. Just talk about Kenobi for a minute. This this boss is gonna take a few little right, um... seconds here. I will say I really did like the flashback between um, you know him and Anakin. I really liked I really liked seeing him and Hayden Christensen finally on screen again. Mm -hmm. That was honestly awesome. <laughs> that they that did great. Um, overall, um, I have to say get off! Best, God fucking damn it! Sorry. The I think one of the best parts in <laughs> Pedofield. Rape field. Oh my god. Oh Bruce. my god. Oh my god. Bluefield, why won't women talk to me? Because you smell. I can smell you through the chat. Take a shower. Yeah, that's probably true. I mean, he, you do have a good sense of smell, so you're like the guy from. Fuck it. Oh, I thought he was going to do his buff there. I guess not. Oh no, now he's doing his buff. Um, Yeah, I need to get naked for this because I, I can't do the mid rolling here. Um, but yeah, yeah, sorry, I, I interrupted, but, um, yeah, it's like, I, I, I don't know what's really, uh, have you seen The Mandalorian? Yeah. What, what did you think about The Mandalorian? Loved it. I thought it was, I mean, I probably liked it more than, like, I thought it was good, I, that doesn't make any sense. Um, <laughs> I liked it more than... No, I get what you mean. No, I liked it. I thought it was yeah. like a really cool, like, you know, space western type thing. Mm-hmm. Um, really interested to see what they're going to do in season three. Yeah. So that's coming soon. But, um, yeah. Okay, uh, sorry. I, I was I was stuttering a lot because I was fighting the boss. Um. Okay, so. Nah, you're good, bro. Okay, with the Mandalorian, I I think there there are a lot of story points that I can't stand in that show, but I think there's also a, like quite a few good things about the show as well. Um. Okay, I, what, I think what? I like the show more than I think it's good. Like as a piece of art, you know, it's like when you like a bad movie. Though I don't think the Mandalorian is like bad. Um, right. Season two was definitely better than season one, though. Um, you know, like one of the things that drove me absolutely crazy in the Mandalorian was in season two at the very in the very last episode, where uh, they're attacking that Imperial ship, and then uh, Gina Carano, you know, her her she's messing with her blaster and she's like, "My gun jammed." How the fuck does a blaster jam? <laughs> First off, it's not a gun; it's a blaster. I'm not. I'm not talking shit about Gina Carano. I love Gina Carano, but like, yeah, no, you're just talking about the character. You're yeah, talking about it's the like, whole scene. what? My gun jammed. This is not a thing in Star Wars. What? Who it's the fuck wrote that? And then, uh, I don't know. Another thing that just drove me crazy in that episode that really took me out of the experience was 
how all the characters basically like you know M mando is actually able to uh take hits uh, well, yeah, be be because his card. armor is so strong um and uh you know it doesn't really seem to like it doesn't seem like blaster bolts carry that much kinetic force though I'm, they probably do and it's just like well how does it it's just not it, that much it probably just like spreads out it, like it absorbs the kinetic force a lot um the armor but uh you know he can afford to take hits no none of his friends are, are can can afford to take hits they don't have the same kind of armor so they don't have they a dodge. damascus steel armor you know uh i know it's not damascus steel armor but like uh, when all of his friends and him, like the other Mandalorians and Gina Carano, they're attacking the Imperial ship. They're just walking around with their guns up, shooting people, like n n not taking any cover. None of them get hit. I hate that stuff yeah, so much. Yeah, Luke Skywalker does that all the time. He doesn't take hits when he's yeah, using Yeah, but Luke Skywalker can like deflect shots and everything like that. That was uh, before he, dude. That was that's. The, I'm I'm literally talking about Luke before he becomes a Jedi. Oh, oh well, yeah. I mean. Obviously, you know, like, old films have stuff like that. Um, I mean, well, I shouldn't say old films have stuff like that. Look, it, it's more excusable for an old film to have that, in my opinion, than uh, new ones. But also, the in, the, in the original films, they still had to duck and cover all the time. Like, yeah, there were mm -hmm. points to where, like, I, I think I know the scene you're talking about where Luke sees Obi-Wan Kenobi die, and he just starts shooting at the stormtroopers, and he's out in the open. That was a bit yeah, different well, because he was like, yeah. yeah, he was very emotional. All throughout the film, though, whenever they're in gunfights, they're taking cover and stuff. Um, they're hiding behind pillars, uh, like bulkheads, that kind of stuff. Like they're all taking cover. They didn't do that at all in the Mandalorian. Like they do it a few times, but especially in that that last episode, any any kind of you know common sense tactics in a gunfight just throw it out the window. Uh, say that funny joke to Sandra about the. Uh, no, what the fuck? I, I do not have a joke like that. Uh, who's the We're other guy? Oh, hey, Folair. Uh, this is Sandra. This is my ex-girlfriend. Um, yeah, wait. So, yeah, and, okay, what I have oh, to say, I though. Oh, my funny Chinese accent. So, I, no, no, no. Um, what I have to they say, though, that I think is no. unforgivable, which I think is so incredibly stupid, is that you can no longer watch The Mandalorian without watching Book of Boa Fett because yeah you know, with, with you know Luke at the very end of the Mandalorian uh Grogu goes with Luke and then at the end of Book of Boa Fett Grogu ends up with Mando again like that whole story arc is explained yeah. and, and everything it's like and also so, I really hate the story arc with Luke in the in the Book of Boba Fett it yeah. makes no sense that he would force Grogu to choose between the Jedi order and and Mandalore and, yeah, and his like family that. and like, like with that. Din Djarin. that makes no sense because yeah. literally in Legends Luke never is like that. He allows marriages to happen in like you know within marriage within the Jedi Temple. Well, in fact, he gets married in Legends. That's Tamara true. Jade. However, the thing is, is that I under like I understand what you're saying. However, it's like the Legends Luke and this Luke is, you know, very different and they're trying I know, to you know, do a just... different thing. But I, I agree with you, though. It's like I wish that they had done a more uh, Star Wars Legends version of Luke to where he was like, more. Like, seriously, Disney, like, here's yeah. the annoying thing. Here's something, here's what, something that's so stupid. Like Kathleen Kennedy, she's been saying this forever. She's going, guys, there's no source material for us to go off of. What do you mean? What are Where you, do you think we're is, getting all this shit wrong? from? She's an idiot. Like, what? You have all the source material in the world. Like, she, oh my god. She has so much fucking source material. It's insane. You literally have, like, an, an entire so country's nuts. worth of lore for for uh, uh, the science fiction universe. And you were just like, nope. Fucking throw. It's like, at least retell some of it if you're really going like, to do that. Like, Bro, it's honestly, insane to me, it's insane. It's that they so did funny because when I found out about all like the expanded universe and all that stuff, when I saw that, I'm going, and when I was first really getting into actual Star Wars, I'm going, wait, we have this much stories, all this history and stuff from a movie with only from a franchise with only six movies. Yeah. And look, I understand that some people are going to be like, oh, well, George Lucas didn't make all that. Yeah, but he still approved it. 
It's like even exactly. if George Martin, uh, George Martin, George Lucas Martin. didn't make it, it, you know, it was still canon and everything. Broad. Imagine if George R. R. Martin <clears throat> wrote a Star Wars show. I don't think it'd be very good, to be honest. I don't think I he don't could. Know. I don't think he could write something. Well, I'm sure he could, but like, I, I don't know. If I don't he'd... know if it'd be good either. I just want to know what it'd be like. Yeah. Actually, well, I mean, it would probably be really good, but it probably wouldn't resemble Star Wars, if that makes no, sense. A bunch of people are just going to be yeah. asking. No, what would happen if he was making it <laughs> is that people would be screaming, why aren't you writing a song of ice and fire? Oh, my God. It, yeah, like, he, he'll, he'll do everything in the fucking world. But except finish for, his main series. Yeah. He literally stopped writing his main series to write a prequel book. Which spawned a even better show, mm -hmm. rather than actually finish his damn books. Yeah. Bruh, finish your books, you moron. Yeah, I don't. I, I don't know what he also said. Something that really pissed me off recently. He was like, "Oh, everybody's so toxic now. Like, Star Wars fans are hating Star Wars stuff. Lord of the Rings fans are hating Lord of the Rings stuff." Like, if you were a Star Wars fan, you liked Star Wars. So why... It's like, are you fucking kidding? Like, after what they did to your show, you're really going to say that, like, just fucking idiocy to me? Are you kidding me, dude? It's like, I like George uh, Martin, but that was one of the dumbest takes I've, I've ever heard from him. If not the dumbest. It's like, bro, what? What kind of logic is that? Just because it's Star Wars, I'm supposed to like it, and it's supposed to be good? Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here. What? It's... Oh, my God. Like, he... He, out of anyone, should understand that. Like, after what HBO did to his series, he should understand damn well that... Like, uh, I don't know. Yeah. That, that was just... I, I found that to be really weird coming from him, of all people. Um, right. Oh, I need to put the ring on before I, uh... Oh my fucking god. Okay. I almost died there. Um... Video game instead of writing his book. Well, look, okay. A side project here and there is... Look, I, I, the thing is that it's his life. You know, he can do what he wants. It's like yeah. Elden Ring. You know, it's like a side project here and there... Like, that's just normal. Like, you don't want to be working on the same book for, like, fucking, like, nonstop. Like, you have to take breaks. You have to work on other projects if you're creative. You know, like, you, you get what I mean. But yeah, it's been, uh, like, what, 13 years? 12, mm -hmm. 13 years since it's The Dance of Dragons? Years. Huh? Yep. Yeah, it's been years since he's been writing it. Yeah, it's... Like, over a decade. Oh, man. Like, the thing is, is that A Song of Ice and Fire could have been the most legendary series ever, honestly. But what how it's going to go down as, you know, like, the show was garbage and the books never got finished. Yeah. Which is... That's going to be sad. A fucking crime, honestly. Like, because if you've read A Song of Ice and Fire, you know it's, like, just a S-tier series. I'm trying to read it. <laughs> I, 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 I try to, but for some reason I always get distracted. All right, see, see you, Seal. Thanks for, uh, thanks for hanging out, dude. Oh, he's leaving. Yeah. Good luck with your, um, your stuff, if you know what I mean. If you're, if you're yeah. still here. Oh God. Uh, did they forget to turn off the? Stream? <gasps> just shut the fuck up for a moment. No, 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 no. I shall not shut the fuck up. Um, look, I mean, we can't make George R. R. Martin uh, write these books, but it's just like... Yes, we can. <laughs> we can hold him hostage. <laughs> One of these days, we're just going to hold him hostage and yeah. force him to finish his books. Like, I, I don't... I think there are several uh, reasons as to why he has... I, I think he's just not writing it because the thing is, is that I, I saw this video recently that was talking about his progress... And a few years in, he said, oh, I have, um, okay, well, hold on. Let me start over. So he had about 1,800 manuscript pages for A Dance with Dragons, and the book ended up being like 1,500. So he had 300 
extra manuscript pages that were immediately going to be added to the next book, which is Winds of Winter. A few years later, he says, uh, I have about 300 pages done of the book. Now people are like, oh, 300 pages in just a year or two? That's pretty good. No, those are the manuscript pages that he had from the book before that like didn't make it into the final thing. Um, and then later on he's like, oh, maybe I'm about like a, uh, a quarter of the way through. Or maybe I'm a third of the way through. And it's like, okay, if a third is 1,500, then he's only wrote like 50. Do you, do you guys get what I mean here? I, I'm probably bastardizing what he said in the video, but it was something along those lines, and it was honestly depressing. I watched that, and I was just like, we're, we're never getting this book, man. All right, I can check Discord now. It's time to check Discord and see what memes are in store for us. Do you like memes, Sandra? I would love memes. Check the Discord. See yeah, what let's, these let's see what's in the to. Discord. Is it wait? Is it in memes or is it uh, blue dies to the easiest souls boss? Wait, what? What did I die to? Leaked. Uh, he has a leaked photo of you and I. Let me see. Bluefield's hair is not that long. Donald Trump. I have leaked. Uh. Ew. What the fuck? Yeah, this was nothing like us. Yeah, that. Yeah. No. 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 Um. Ultramarines listening to their father in the old dog pond. Right now. I think uh, I think Henry Cavill will probably play as the Emperor. I saw an edit of him as the Emperor of Mankind, and he fits the part. I've seen so many of those. Yeah, I've not jacked off to them. I did not do that. Oh God! All right, I got it in the stream. I'm tired. Yep. We streamed for about two hours, a little under two hours, but uh. Based. Yeah. It was fun. Yep, fun. I'm glad, hey, this was better than the last stream. Huh? This was better than the last stream with you and I. Yeah, that was very much a last mo uh, minute, like... And, al and also, I only streamed for like an hour that time. Hey, wait, is the stream over? Uh... Good night, everybody. Sleep yeah. tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Night, losers. Oh, don't 